my name is Nikki Laley. Welcome to my front porch. I am running for Georgia State House District 14. And next to me is my daughter. This is Reese. And she wanted to stay out here with me tonight because it's her birthday. So happy birthday, Reese. So um, today I wanted to change things up a little bit. I want to talk about giving why it's so important to our family and how it kind of got started. So a few years ago, I was a youth group leader and we had a unit on money. So the money uh, portion taught us how to save, how to spend wisely, how to set uh, them up for their future so they would be debt free. So in the class, we uh, came across this amazing quote, and what was that quote, Reese? Some people give time, some people give money, some their skills and connections. Some literally gave life's blood, but everyone has something to give. So after we heard this quote, it was life-changing, um, because everybody has something to give. A friend of mine had come over and shared with us this ministry on drilling clean water wells in third world, country, in third world countries. And so it was about $6,500 that we'd have to raise. And we were a group of teenagers that had virtually no jobs and great ideas on, what, on how to do things. So we came up with these ideas, we raised the money, and um, one of the premises we had when we raised the money is that we'd give up something that meant a lot to us to give to somebody else who needed it. So say I were to go get a coffee, instead of using the money to get the coffee, I would give that up and I would put it towards uh, drilling the well or giving it to somebody else. So I could do that one day a week, I could do it two days a week, five days a week, and uh, that could be one of the things that I personally could give up. And everybody had their own thing, and and so um, we worked on that for about a year. We started a um, concession stand at uh, basketball games, and uh, I think we baked cakes one time. There was a, a bunch of really awesome ideas that we had, and so in turn, that turned into our family because my children were a lot younger then and they saw what we were doing, but they decided that they wanted to help as well. So my oldest, he um, gave up his birthday gifts for one year. He invited everybody to his birthday and he said, you know, instead of gifts, I would really like everybody to give me uh, money to go towards drilling the well. And so that's what he did that year. And Reese here, she decided that she wanted to uh, help some people around the world with chickens and some clothes. Was that what it Goats. was? Goats. And so they wrote a book. I think they were in first or second grade. Second grade. Second grade. They wrote a book and they sold it. And so they were able to help people uh, from around the world, which is pretty stinking amazing. Don't you think, Reese? <laughs> so anyway... Um, we had kind of given that to, this is kind of just who we are. We, we just like to give back. Uh, part of that is we like to run a 5K and we like to raise money for a resource center. Uh, earlier, uh, last year, this year, I can't remember what it was, but we had some friends we got together and we collected wipes uh, to give to our local resource center. We just find different things in our area that we're passionate about and we like to give back to it. So a while ago, maybe two and a half years, maybe two years, I can't remember, we started getting involved in our local political party so that we can learn about what was going on in DC, what was going on locally, and my kids act like they don't like it. <laughs> they act like it is the most boring thing ever, but I can tell you that we have uh, great conversations from it, and I think that we are learning a lot. Do you think so, Reese? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, mainly they just like the donuts, I think, that they bring in the mornings. <laughs> you feed them and they will come. 
So anyway, <laughs> anyway, um, so we started getting involved in that and then we had these other issues. We were fostering and so we saw some of the issues that had in fostering um, and I would talk to our elected officials because they represent us and you know they did really really well to try to uh, get some of my issues addressed and they would help me out and that's kind of what it's all about and I would help out with campaigns and I would kind of travel around and meet other people who were excited about um, bringing positive change to our communities and so when this opportunity arose for uh, the seat to be open then um, I had to think about it. I made a list kind of about why I shouldn't do it and the list I felt kind of wasn't good enough. I just kind of felt this tug at my heartstring that God was telling me to do it and to give back to my community and to give back in the ways of things that were happening that I was passionate about because I care about our families and I care about our kids and uh, so that's kind of what we're doing is just kind of doing it to give back and uh, do you have anything else to say? So like me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And uh, hopefully I will be on here again tomorrow. I missed a couple days. I'm sorry. I'll try to make it up to you. I'll try to maybe post a couple extra pictures. Or pictures, videos. And I just want to wish Reese a very happy birthday. I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.